Hello, it is Alpha Crafter one with, 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 with another gaming video. So, you know how the last time my gaming thing glitched out? Apparently, I can't record more than 23 minutes or so. So, I'm oh, sorry, I'm leaving my microphone. Um, so, it just started glitching out. Also, I have played a little bit, actually a lot of this so i am kind of advanced in the games but without further ado let's jump into the game because i have no idea what i'm gonna do i might free a divine beast but you know what i don't know one sec okay so let's see continue had no ancient tech lab Swimming in cold water will lower your body heat and cause you to take damage. Cooked food and special garb won't help you. So I also unlocked... I also unlocked... So I got all these cool weapons. I also got a few cool bows. Um, got a little bit of shields. Like, they're damaged, though. I got stealth masks. And I also upgraded them because they're like some fairy. I got a ton of materials. I got some food. And I got two spirit orbs, a paraglider. I got the paraglider and 618 rupees. I also got stasis, magnesis, remote bomb, and crayonis and camera. I also have a horse now, too. I also discovered Hatna Village in Kakariko Village. I cannot, I can never say that for some reason. I also learned how to shield surf. Where's my horse? Also, if I hit these, it will kick me on my player gliding, so. Da da. Da da. The paraglider touched it, but it didn't register. That's funny. Anyway. Oh wait, my horse is back here. Don't mind me, I'm just being stealthy. Let's go, beta. We should go to, ah, oh, which one's closer? Which one's the closest one? Yeah, that one. Okay. I'm gonna go get into the shrine, I mean. Oh right, he can't cause we're in the village. There we go. It's a little bit hard to control. Sorry if this is lagging, it might be a little bit. So far I've slept through two blood moons, so. No problem. Well, that's unfortunate. Get Boke. Oh, wait, he's already dead. Okay. Let's go! This is the first horse that I tamed, so. I guess you could do that. Um, okay. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. 
horses automatically stay on roads, so. I just feel like you're gonna get ambushed if you go right here. Ah. I'm just a dude riding a horse. Don't mind me. You probably can't even catch up to me anyway. Still following me? Nope. I know exactly who you are. Uh, vicious sickle. Uh, why not use the serpentine spear? This is actually a hidden enemy. <laughs> you see? Let's go. Um. Attack. Oh, dang it. But this is. Oh, man. Some good rupees and mighty bananas. That was fun to raid. I remember raiding that place. So anyway, there's some guy here and, oh, I passed him. But anyway, I've been kind of searching for random horses and, oh, come on, you've got to be kidding me. Oh, I just hit my horse. It's okay, it's okay. I wonder if horses can be killed. Hmm. Yeah, probably. Those just don't look very safe, so. I just pass on to ya. Sorry, I have bad writing. Whoops, <laughs> I missed. It's kind of just like, oh, my ones. Anyway, there's this little tactic that you can use. Um, to whistle, you press I think you press, to whistle you press if you're playing on a, if you're playing on Joy-Con grip, you press the down button with the arrow down, and if you're playing on Pro grip, um, you press the bottom D-pad, but that's whistle, and if you hold down whistle while running, while walking, and then you spam B, you'll actually be able to run without consuming stamina. a shortcut but a dangerous one. I think almost all of these... Oh! Whoa. 
That's close. to board horse. I have two of the horses, Fee and Fee 2, which kind of looks like Phil. But I don't know if I can do the Divine Beast this ah. th chapter, but anyway. So, as I was saying, I did play this like a little bit, a lot actually. So, I do have all this awesome gear so except that i have no arrows arrows are like 20 rupees like for five and that's just a rip off do you know if you hit that um if you hit the x the thing will break so if it's like a, a really tough looking moblin like a blue moblin is standing on one of these oh what does this hold Ah, I can sell that. I already have three of those. But, if like a moblin, a really tough looking moblin standing on one of those, you could just hit the X and it'll fall into water. Fact, I was watching a YouTube video on this. You, moblins and bokoblins can't swim. It's one of the huge things that you need to know, but they just can't swim. When they're coming to swimming, they never took their swimming lessons, haha. But they, when it comes to swimming, they just drown. I remember I was fighting a bokoblin. It was, I was, had low health, and then it went like, well, just in short terms, I hit it off a cliff, and guess what was there? Water, so... So, if I go... Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Oh, no. Oh, you know what that might be? That's totally the one in uh, Goron City. I can't do that. It's impossible. That's totally it. That's a problem. Um... one over there that's far away though that's that's Rito village and so that's far away but you can get a level two um, level two uh, what is it oh cool protection like snow quill or something it's kind of nice but it costs like a thousand rupees I already I actually had two one two thousand and ten rubies. Rubies, uh -huh. Rubies actually sell for two hundred and ten. So if you find a ruby, find your nearest find the nearest oh no 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 no. If find the nearest tr trader and just trade for it. That is an electric something something. One sec. I've killed one. Uh what is it? Electric keys. I don't know if they're like hard, but I know uh, they're just annoying. I mean, where's he? They're easy to spot though, that's a good thing. Paraglide and da 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 da. Reminds me so much of Fortnite. I haven't played Fortnite, but I've seen a video I played it once at my friend's house. <laughs> I make that? Let's just assume that I can land right in the low cobbling camp. Oh no.
Oh yeah, my stamina is going down fast. Should I risk it? I might have to risk it. Do I have to risk it? Should I risk it? No. Technically, doing that is actually more risky than um, trying to get across there, but still. So now we just stand here and wait till night is over, or we can just swim across this conveniently placed lake. Do you know if you're under in? The guy said, if you're swimming around these, you swim faster, and it's true. If a fish comes up and, like, bites me. This is the thing how I complete most games, though. I just am so courageous like this. So I'm like, let's do this! But the only problem that takes me, like, a ton of tries to actually do it. Oh, thank goodness. No, 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 no. What do I have? That's not going to be strong enough. Oh, that's not, that's not bad actually. Oh, keys. Oh my gosh, what is that? OMG, what is that? Oh my gosh, that was like so weird looking. It looked at, I mean, the way its eyes were placed. That's creepy. Okay, we're going stealth. I bought this set for about 1,800 rupees. This might be the best suicide mission I've ever done. What is that? Thank you. I mean that she could sense her. Really ticks me off sometimes. I got Sheikah Sensor Plus too, so I'm gonna do I'm gonna go find a blue Bokavan so I can be like Can you track this and tell me when there's one close? Yes. How much arrows do I have? 37, that should be good enough. I'm gonna need a more precise bro. Bro. This guy's lookout or something? First.
I need to, I really need to put this in my high roll competing. How do I access it? I go into here. No, I do not want to look for a guardian sword. Target with sensor. That guy has a loot chest. Oh my gosh, I can't. Dang. I need to somehow get past them without alerting the entire area. Wait. That worked. Yeah, this is what I was afraid of. See ya. Oh my gosh, that was way too close for some shit. Dang, what bow does he have? How much arrows did I lose? Three. Okay. Stew side squad. Nope. Okay, you're the one with fire, you're with ice. Dispose. Fire and ice, huh? Oh, crap. No, no. Exact wrong time to do this. I have an idea. I can activate my room. First I kill you. Kill you. Take your death. Okay, that was too close for comfort. Oh, got him. Bye bye. No. Okay. Okay, good. And die. Okay, that is kind of unfair, but... Well, that worked. Hey, but I'm my inventory is full. But its durability is like...
Okay. Are there any tricks? No, there are not. Question mark, yay? Yay? Question mark? Okay, that's good. That's okay. Honestly, I could have been given some horrible loot. But continuing on, I'm not going up that way, I'm going up this way. to use a quick dispatcher. Dang, I feel like someone that's serious on stealth. That works too, okay. That seriously actually works. I mean, better for me, that skeleton does not look like it's actually... That skeleton does not look like it plans to stay dead. And I don't plan to stay down, so... It's like huge hulking bow cobbling on top. Ah! What is that? Blizzard. One sec. Okay, well, I'm just gonna go for a sec. Okay, so I'm at the top of this tower. I made it somehow. And I probably will have to wrap up my video after this, so. So I'm gonna, once this loads, I'm gonna have to cut the video because it's getting too long. And this is what happens when you activate a tower, too. So, okay. Okay. Yeah, this is like, I remember I watched a comic, it's just like, it links screaming as it loads because it takes so long. But, so yeah. Well, I guess that's all for this video. Signing out. Oh, one sec. Want a good view of Death Mountain. Signing out. Alpha Crafter. One sec. Oh, wrong button. Wrong button. Whoops. <laughs>